Okay, you're looking at the Hilton Hotel. You can see all the different uh, windows that are blown out. The storm hit this side of the hotel. And if you look up in that top corner, you'll see that it's almost entirely taken out. Here's a little closer view of the corner of the top of the condos and the hotel rooms up there. You can see it just, I can't imagine the damage on the inside. Some of the downtown shops, awnings blown away. Uh, you can even see the church here has been damaged somewhat. See that bronze statue got knocked down. The roof right there got pulled off. 76 strip. And basically, it just came straight down through this and jumped downtown. That's where it hit the, uh, the Hilton Hotel and did so much damage before jumping on out past the lake and hitting the trailer court. This is the Veterans of uh, Foreign Wars Museum. It has a plane used to be sitting in front of it on that stool. It looks like it's been through its own war. You can hear a chainsaw. This building's just been destroyed. The utility crews are out on the job. They've got to get these lines back up. As you can tell, the, the line just totally knocked down all the way through. You can see some of the work going on down there on the strip. Okay, it's been a long day here in Branson. I'm here in front of our office. As you can see, it's in great shape. It wasn't hit. Uh, we're probably a mile and a half from the strip where I took some video earlier. You could see the devastation down the strip. You could see the Hilton Hotel. Uh, it's, it's just been terrible today to see what's done. I mean, really, as a whole, Branson fared very well. It's just a small amount of area that was damaged, but boy, it was hit hard. Uh, we appreciate you know everybody's thoughts and prayers. We've had so many people, Brad, Jamie, uh, calling us, checking on us to see if we we're okay. Fortunately, everyone is okay in the office. Unfortunately, there were a few deaths and uh, there were some people that were seriously injured. Our prayers go out to those families and those folks and we'll get this cleaned up. It won't take too long. I know the utility crews and the city and the fire folks and the police folks and everybody's you know they've canceled all community activities and everybody's just lending a hand and coming together that's what make Brant, that's what makes branson such a special place and uh, such a great place to live and a great place to visit and uh, we're just thankful that it wasn't uh you know near as bad as joplin or as bad as it could have been so thanks everybody for checking on us